All right, before this video actually starts, I just Instagram called Max. Say hello, Max. Hi. How are you, Max? Good, how are you? Are you the biggest Apple fan in the entire world? Yes. I'm doing it. This is no unboxing of the 2020 iPad Pro. This is actually a reboxing of the 2020 iPad Pro because I'm actually returning the 2020 iPad Pro. A lot of you guys are gonna say, you knew what was on the 2020 iPad Pro. Why did you buy it if you didn't really like it in the first place? Well, first of all, what is new with this iPad? This new iPad has the A12Z Bionic chip. It's got the new LiDAR scanner. I was actually pretty excited. I was actually pretty excited about the new LiDAR scanner, about the A12Z Bionic, because it was so much faster, theoretically. Um, also, the 12.9 inch. I was always, I always use the 11 inch iPad Pro. Where is it? My girlfriend is actually, I always use this 11 inch iPad Pro, sorry. Um, so yeah, and then I was super excited that I was actually gonna get the 12.9 inch because it was huge and I'm gonna say, um, I was wrong with everything that I just said. I knew that for me the LiDAR scanner was gonna be pointless. I'm not saying that the LiDAR scanner is pointless, but AR, um, throughout 2019 for example, I think I can recall four times that I've used AR, so it's not something that I use on my daily life or in my daily month, like I don't use it. I, I just don't use AR. So the lighter scanner is pointless for me. I'm sure it's not gonna be pointless for a lot of you guys, but it is pointless for me. Next up, the A12Z Bionic chip. I haven't noticed the difference with, with the 2018 iPad Pro and the 2020 iPad Pro. And that's kind of ridiculous. Apple is, you know, targeting and Apple is making the A12Z Bionic is faster than your 2018 iPad Pro. I haven't noticed a difference. And you know, sometimes I push my iPad Pro quite hard. I graphic design on my iPad Pro and I have a bunch of layers. So maybe Apple's, and maybe it's Apple's fault for making the 2018 iPad Pro so incredibly good. And by the way, you guys saw my 2020 iPad Pro review. And if you guys haven't checked that out, you guys need to check that out. And I told you guys my full opinion on it. And I said that this iPad Pro is amazing. It's amazing, but it is not worth an upgrade from the 2018 to the 2020. And then the size, I got the 12.9 inch as I said, and I thought I was gonna like it a lot. And to be honest, I like it a lot. And I totally recommend the 12.9 inch to a lot of people. I actually just made a 12.9 inch versus 11 inch iPad Pro size comparison. Um, but I'm just more of an 11 inch iPad Pro guy. Um, maybe, for the next generation of iPad, if there's a lot of new features, I might consider getting the 12.9 inch, but how portable it is, how portable the 11 inch iPad Pro is, is incredible. For watching movies, this guy is awesome because it's such a big screen and it's just a way much better experience. And you gotta have a way better experience with a lot of things getting the big iPad. But for me, I just prefer the 11 inch for how comfortable, how light, it actually is. So yeah, those are my thoughts. To be honest, if the iPad Pro was, if the 2020 was cheaper, um, I would definitely, you know, maybe keep it. But this thing is super expensive. And as for me, since I have the 2018 iPad Pro, I'm returning the iPad Pro to Apple. I'm putting it back where it came from and I am shipping it right back. And I'm kind of sad. I'm kind of sad to be honest because I was actually pretty super excited about this 2020 iPad Pro. And I still am, and I still recommend it to a lot of people. But once again, coming from the 2018 iPad Pro, it just doesn't make sense. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know in the comments down below. What do you guys think about the 2020 iPad Pro? Do you guys do you guys have the same opinion as me? Or do you guys think it's totally worth it? Do you guys think that it's totally worth the upgrade? But to be honest, whatever you say, you're not going to convince me because... Or maybe, maybe you will, but probably not. Maybe you can try, but... Yeah. Anyways. Peace. That's life. That's life. That's what all the people say.